Hey guys, welcome back to Channel Coffee with the Moms. Lisa's here today, and today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So I decided to go to Dollar Tree and grab one thing for Aiden's birthday party. And I'll tell you this, I had to grab a basket. Always grab a basket when you're at Dollar Tree because you never know what you're going to find. And of course, fall is here. Well, fall items is here. Halloween items are in stock. And I'll tell you this, if you see it, get it, buy it because the next time you go, it will not be there. So just, you know, I know fall is not here and even Christmas is not here, but start thinking about it, guys, because before you know it, fall is going to be here. So let's just get right into it. Like I said, I went in there for Aiden's birthday party and I had to grab like a couple like napkins and plates and stuff like that. But I grabbed some of these princess um, tiaras and I will be doing a video on Aiden's birthday party. Um, how I set it up. It's Mario, Luigi, and Princess Peach theme. Um, birthday party and I always do birthday party themes for my kids. Um, so, you know, just to kind of let you guys know, but I had to grab some of these. They had them in all different colors. You get a four pack for $8. So I decided to get the silver, even though I needed gold for Princess Peach. Um, I decided to just do silver. So I'm going to create my own tiaras for that. Anyway, here comes the signs. If you guys don't know me, I love signs. I don't know why. I just love them. But this one's a new one. Now, they always always had this, like, type of sign. But this one says, give thanks, happy harvest, gather together, blessings, all are welcome, and thanksgiving. Now, just to kind of let you guys know, you can DIY this on the back. So, all you Cricut people out there or DIYers out there, these are great for a dollar to make your own signs. And you guys, this is for fall, and then you can do one for Christmas. Why not? So I picked up that. They had like two other different, different ones. And then I came across this. What Dollar Tree? This is like a yard steak. But um, I do live in like a colder climate area. So hopefully it won't get that cold so I can put this outside. But anyway, this says Farm Fresh Pumpkins, 25 cents. I wish they never did the sparkle here. Look at that. Look how much spark Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree Sparkle is not a joke. Okay, so you can always DIY this, that kind of thing. But um, I'm probably going to paint over this because I am not like a sparkly type of girl. So I might revamp it. Who knows? But this was the only one I seen. I wish they had a blue one. Like a blue, like a darker blue. Right? So I don't know. Um, another thing I came across were these like wooden signs. Now this one says Wicked and you can paint them. They had tons of them, tons of them. So I'm trying to do like a Hocus Pocus theme. So, um, on one of my shelves. So I was thinking something like this would go pretty perfect with that. Um, with that type of theme I'm going for, I picked up some of these like pumpkins. These are pretty. These were here last year. And in my Dollar Tree, these go quick, especially the um, gold ones. But I've seen the purple. I don't think I've seen the purple last year, but I pick up a purple this year. So I grabbed those. I thought these were really, really cute. I love them. I absolutely love them. Um, I did grab some of these wood ornaments. They come out with these every single year. I'm pretty sure these are a repeat. I feel like I've hauled these like a year ago. But this one's the hats and you get five of them. These are awesome. I love these things. I DIY these all the time. These are just the regular pumpkins and you could tell like this, this one's fall um, with this color and this one's Halloween. So it's a different color and I got the jack-o'-lanterns these are great especially if you're like a teacher anything like that guys arts and crafts for kids during um, school you know because in case we have to do art class at home 
this is great guys especially for a dollar um i came across these and these were one of my favorites from last year i feel like they've changed this up i feel like this one is a repeat with these like boxes this one says casting spells i love that it is purple it's not black so if it is giving a black hue to it it's not black it's purple and it just has that black inside but these are great. I love these. They had like so many of them. A lot of them. But they had three different sizes. They had a bigger one. This is a medium size. And this is the smallest size. Now as you guys can see, this is a little different. This one has a little shine to it. And this one's more of a matte. It's the same thing. It's just a little shine. These are super cute. I love this. If you guys are a Harry Potter fan, hello. Here you go. Right? So... I got that. I got this one that says Poisons. So even if, it, if you wanted to put a gift in there, I don't know. But these are super cute just to display. Um, I did come across some of these spiders. They always have these every single year. Um, they always have purple and gold. So I picked up purple this year. Now I will tell you this. When you take these out, there's going to be glitter everywhere. So make sure you hairspray them. But these are cute. I love those. This is brand new. Um, I've never seen anything like this before. But you get a three piece of Witch's Broom. Now they have a black, which I pick up a black. They had purple and orange. Um, so I just did the, the traditional black. These are really cool for a dollar. Look how cute these are. How stinking cute these are just a display. I love that. You can even put these on a wreath, anything. Um, maybe, I don't know, like a picture frame that you DIY. You can put this on the end of it. How stinking cute is this? So I actually got a two pack or two of them because I'm just thinking of DIYs in my head. Um, ugh, it's all over me now, but make sure you look at the ribbon. The ribbon's very important to look at, um, cause this was in the Halloween ribbon. It was not in the fall ribbon. Hello, black and white checker. Now, just to let you guys know, because Christmas is right around the corner too, pick this up for Christmas. But as you guys can see, it is the Halloween um, like crafter square, like logo right there with the purple. So just to kind of guys let you know, if you like black and white checker for Christmas, why not? I love this stuff. So I picked up two. I should have picked up more, but I didn't. And then I think this is my favorite, favorite ribbon that they came out with for fall. Hello. Look at that for a dollar. So you have like a burlap with a little gold. The orange burlap with a little gold. Pumpkins. And then look at the trucks. And I'm such a truck girl. I love the trucks. So I thought these were so cute for $8. So I picked. I am like waiting for them to put their Christmas stuff out. Because I'll tell you this. If this is this good for ribbon. Wait until you see Christmas. Hopefully. Praying. So another thing I picked up. My kids were with me. So they want to get these cute little pens. So why not, you know, something that they can write in, you know, for whatever, maybe for school, that kind of thing. So I don't know. They're like squishy and their eyes pop out. Look at that. Of course, my kids are going to love that. <laughs> I don't know. These are the only two I found. Um, I did pick up one of these. Now, I would never pick this up. But um, this is great for like a teenager's bedroom or anything like that. But this is awesome for a DIY. So I am thinking of DIYs for Christmas. And this is what I'm thinking with this. You know how they have like Santa's key, the elf key, or like whatever key. So I'm thinking of taking these out, painting this, putting the North Pole keys or something, and then put those little keys on these little hooks that's what I'm thinking of so 
um, why not? I'll try it out for a dollar. And they had all different ones. Um, candles. You guys, you guys know I love old ones for candles. So this one is cinnamon spice. I highly recommend the cinnamon spice because they always come out with cinnamon spice around this time. So I always stack up on cinnamon spice. And then honey vanilla. Oh my goodness. It it's like um Oh my god, it's like those old country stores. That's what it reminds me of when you first walk into an older country store. That's what this honey vanilla reminds me of. I love this. I should have got two of them. And then last thing I got was another one of these. Um, these are rub-on transfers by Crafter Square. I actually really like them. It reminds me of um, Tim Holtz collection. So... Why not? I picked up another one of these because I already hauled one of these a while ago. So I really like this. But yeah, guys, that's it for my Dollar Tree haul. Thanks for watching. And if you like Dollar Trees, give me that thumbs up. And if you didn't subscribe, you can always subscribe. And we'll see you next one. Bye, guys. Take care.